What's up, guys? Another Mr. Awesome video today. You probably think I look different. That's because I took a shower. I look like a baby powdered. <laughs> I don't care. I don't freaking care. Um, today we're going to be doing some weird video. It's going to be, I'm going to be introducing a new season of Mr. Awesome. Also, you probably notice my shirt. It says, I'd rather be riding a roller coaster. That's true. I'd rather be riding a roller coaster. Making this stupid video. No, it's not that stupid. I wish I could just announce this in my channel and not have to make a video and all, but no. Um, today I'm going to be introducing something to you. Introducing. <laughs> that, that's not family friendly, I'm bleeping that out. Where the fuck is it? Hang on, guys. I think I'll find this. Oh, I'm just going to cut this out. Well, I'm not cutting it out because it's going to take too long. And I need to post this fast. Okay. So, for my school, which I'm not telling you the name of, um, I have a February break. And, well, I'm on that break right now, and I made a whole schedule right here. February break schedule, Mr. Awesome, what does that say? Winter um, special. So, this is basically the, winter, the Mr. Awesome winter special. There's going to be daily videos today like there's going to be daily videos today for eight days straight i'm showing what's going to happen throughout my february break so this is basically the schedule saturday there's going to be a new video coming up later there's going to be something and it's going to go through all the whole week and it'll end on sunday not this sunday the sunday after this sunday and then our thing will be over pretty sad but um that's basically what we're going to be doing sorry this is kind of like a a um uh, short video. I just needed to get that out there. But to attract people to know this information, I'm actually going to be doing something. Okay? 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 All right. So just remember that, okay? February break. Those episodes starting today. But today we're going to be doing a little bit of slant new. Now, as you know, this is kind of like a vlog video because I'm walking around with the camera. Usually I prop it up if we're doing something. Here's Matthew. I don't know what the heck he's doing. Why are you looking at Kobe Bryant? He died. It's pretty sad. Kobe Bryant died. Okay. So we're basically going to be going downstairs to my basement. So yeah. So here we are in my basement. And you probably know there's some stuff down here in my basement. Yeah, you already know that. It's pretty obvious. This is a finished basement. I don't know if you've seen it before. But today's video is going to be an animal video. Look here. Here is my bunny. His name is Ranger. If you saw my Meet All 11 of my pets video, then you'd know that that is my bunny. His name's Ranger. And I'm not going to say any more names. I'm just going to basically, because you should have been there for the video. But, um, today's video is going to be everything. No, today's video is going to be how to, how to turn, how to work a tropical, how to work a fish tank. Basically, it's going to be how it works. Okay. So I'm going to be doing two fish tanks today, and let's get this started. So over here is our first fish tank, right there. This fish tank contains This fish tank contains a one-year-old comet goldfish, aka koi. And then a uh, regular goldfish right here. And I'm basically going to be showing you how to work a, this 29 gallon tank right here for these fish. Now, these fish are, um, these fish are freshwater and they don't need any heater. You should keep their, temp, their um, water temp around 69 degrees. But, yeah, that's mainly like that part. Um, so I don't know where they put it. Oh, wait. Yeah, um, you can also get this um, temperature gun to um, you basically open the lid right here. There's like a little lid right here. It's meant for food, but then you can just 
check the temperature, or you can get it. That's not the point here. Um, so basically, how do you work this fish tank? So you probably notice this cord right on top here. This is the light cord. To turn on and off the light, there's a switch right here. It will come up to your fish tank. You can just turn it on and off. But don't do it too much, otherwise it will break. Now to disconnect the entire system, you pull this cord out, like that. And if you want, if you only have one light system for your two fish tanks, then you can disconnect this cord right here. Then you can move it over here. Then there's a cord right over here, and you can attach it to there to light up this tank. Normally, I only have this tank on, but today, because I'm mainly focusing on this tank for this part of the video, we're going to have this tank on. Alright, now the next step to having the perfect fish tank and basically to make your fish happy is um lots of plants inside the tank. Now this is this this doesn't really it's this video is how to work a fish tank, but this is basically what you'll need for an entire fish tank. Now you'll obviously need this lid right here. This is the lid right here. It can come up like this. And of course it's wet. But Basically, how to work this lid is, so basically, if you want to take off the lid to basically scoop up your fish to, if you need to transfer them to a different tank or anything, you're going to need to turn off this light, disconnect the cord, put this cord down there, wherever you want, um, and because it is connected to this light set, under the lid, see this bar right there? Those are the lights. That's where you need to disconnect this so it's not connected. Then you remove the lid, as so shown right here. And the lid is removed and you can do whatever you want. Like put in new plants, take out the fish, do water changes, etc. Etc. Not etc. Um, and then what you're going to need to do next is... Um, so, there's this thing over here, this little box right here, it's called a filter. Here it is. Right there, it's a filter. As you can see, I've got the, like, the filter right here. This is what cleans the fish tank's water. Because as you know, there are fish turds. Like, these fish will poop in the tank, okay? They're, they're just like any other animal, they will poop. And they will get the water dirty with algae and stuff that builds up from the food and from their poop, as you can see on the side of the tanks. And um, with this, this is the perfect thing to clean it. However, it doesn't stop there. You're gonna need to plug this into an outlet. From the back of the filter right here, there's a little cord connected to it, right here, as you can see, and it connects to here, and it's gonna be needed to plug into here. Now that's not it yet. There's lots more stuff you're gonna need for this process. So basically, you have it plugged in, right? You have the filter running, but you're missing one thing, the cartridge. That's right, the cartridge. Here they are, as mentioned. They're top fan cartridges. There are six of them in here. This is a six month supply. Monthly, you're going to need to change the cartridge. So basically here we have all the cartridges in this bag and stuff. So basically, um, the way to change the cartridge is, so basically, let, let's say a month has passed, your fish tank is crappy, and you're gonna need to clean it, right? Well, there's one thing you're gonna need. A top fin bucket. This can clean all your gooey stuff out. It can also help with water changes. So basically what you're gonna need to do is, as you can see, there's this little lever right here thing. You can pull, and as you can see, this blue thing comes up, you need to avoid the blue thing. You need to push it down. This is the cartridge right here. It inserts in this slot right in the back of the filter. When you have the 
when you have the um this blue plastic thing right here, you're gonna need to put it behind it in this in this like special holster, and then you're gonna carry the cartridge over and put it into your handy dandy bucket, and then you have no cartridge in there. So what you're gonna need to do is you're gonna need to open up your bag of cartridges. And you're gonna need to withdraw one of the cartridges from inside the bag. And see this, this is a clean cartridge right here. See this little thing? You're going to need to come over here and put the cartridge right into this little slot behind here in the cartridge, um, in, in the filter. Then a clean new cartridge is inside of the filter to keep your little fish friends happy. But that's not all we need to talk about, about this um, fish tank business thing. So you basically have this, right? So once a year, you're going to need to clean out the whole tank, okay? Because, you know, th this works and all, but you need more than that. You're going to need this hose, a special fish tank hose. And what you're gonna do with this hose is, so you basically need to get your bucket right here, right? Your bucket right here. And you're gonna need to place it on the ground and see this hose right here? You're gonna need to put this right here. You're gonna need to put the other side of the hose right in there. And then what you're gonna need to do is to clean out the entire tank, Look, you're going to need to remove the lid of the fish tank. You're going to put it aside. And then what you're going to need to do is, you see this right here? This end of the hose thing? You're going to place it into the fish tank. Right there. And then, to get the suction started to suck all your, all your crappy water out, you're gonna start pumping this, this like thing right here, and then it's gonna start sucking all the icky water out. And that's basically how you will do a water change in tanks. I'm not, I'm obviously not gonna do one right now because my fish tank is perfectly fine and it takes a lot of work. But um, yeah, that's basically how you will do it. You'll just pump the thing, and that's how it basically work. A fish tank. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for more videos like this on Mr. Awesome. And if you haven't yet, don't forget, go down there and click the red button to be subscribed and notified with, yeah, just subscribe, okay? And don't forget to like this video and comment on what other videos do you think I should do? You know, just, just comment that down below because I need some comments. Also, if you see the, the, the comments down below, if it says, like, comments are turned off, just stay tuned for that video, and I will turn them back on, because I allow comments. Also, um, also, that's basically it, so we'll see you guys in the next video, and don't forget, live life with an awesome lifestyle. Peace.